where can you see the Junior League in action? All over the Minneapolis community. We're in schools, community centers, hospitals, shelters, and even helping at correctional facilities. Before I joined the Junior League, I had no idea how much this group does and actually has been doing for nearly 90 years. It's pretty impressive. Our passion is for volunteering, and our focus is on closing the achievement gap in Minneapolis, which involves addressing health, education, and basic human needs. Our Kids in the Kitchen program is one way we're doing just that. Through this program, we engage children in the preparation of healthy meals while educating them and their parents on the importance of nutrition, healthy living, and regular exercise. Because we know that healthy bodies lead to healthy minds that are ready to learn at school. Jacqueline, all right, can you spell it for me, honey? Uh, my name is Lori Gardner. I've been with the league for quite a few years. Okay, good job. We go into schools in our communities and we teach children about how to eat healthy and how to how to put together a nutritious meal. Does anybody like to eat lemons? Oh, oh. I'm Mary Lynn Giono. I'm a teacher here at Green Central Elementary School. The girls we have here and our school population, we have a lot of parents who are busy working a couple of jobs and so some of these kids don't have parents cooking for them at home, so this will be a skill they can transfer to home. I mean, they throw this so with peanut butter. Perfect. 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 You gotta look at the ingredients. One third. Oh, one more minute. Okay, let's finish it. Make one more and then we can. Oh, they're too big. Too big. Oh. Remember, it'll cook too slow then. Really? Meatballs. Have you ever made the apple parvios have peanut butter and honey and chocolate chips in them? And it's apple, so it's really good. A lot of these kids have to wait for their parents to get home in the evenings and they are fixing snacks for themselves. So a lot of the times we go in and teach them about the importance of selecting a carrot over a candy bar or peanut butter over, you know, jelly beans. Everyone was really excited, enthusiastic, they participated, and um, we're, we're looking forward to seeing that continue. For more information about the Junior League, visit our website at www.jlminneapolis.org or call us at 612-238-8460.